What's, What's up, guys? guys? It's the Wolf Fowler here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an intro on YouTube for free and easy. So let's get right into it. So first, you're going to want to go to Panzoid. I'll leave I'll, everything on this video. I'll leave a link in the description for. Um, but first, you're going to want to go to Panzoid. www.panzoid.com, and then you'll see a bunch of templates and stuff. So you just click on one, and then it'll do this. Then you just open it in Clip Maker. And if you want to go, if you want to use a different Intro, uh, intro, then you just click on it one on the left over here. Sorry, my Wi Fi is not the best, so it's gonna take a while to load. But, um, there's gonna be a bunch of other options over here if you want to, if you want to use any of those, or you can search up your your own intro if you want to use a different one. Let's just wait, look, wait for it to load right here. Like, there's a bunch over here, but I think I'll just stick with this one. You can also go down. And then you and then you can click you can click on the button open and click maker and click maker. But I know I'm just waiting for it to load because what my Wi-Fi is pretty bad. Okay, so you can go down and click on more creations and then you can search one in if you want to, but. So see, all you have to do is press toggle render preview, and then press play. So, um, you can you just keep it as that if you want that as your intro, or you can change all these other stuff. So you can go to basics, and your video resolution is just, it should be right at the beginning, unless you want to like shorten the video or something, and this one's shorter or longer intro. Then you go to scene, which doesn't really do anything. I mean, like honestly, I've never had to use scene, and my intro is still perfectly fine. Objects, this is how you change. Let me go on this real quick. So it says template right there. So you're going to click, click on it. Change template to your name, so I'm just gonna put wolf right now, and then click enter. Then you're gonna have to change it for all the templates. Or if it says like name there first, then you wanna change it to that. Then you're gonna wanna change name to, to your intro that you want on it. Then you can change the font too if you wanna enter all this other stuff that doesn't really matter that much, because it looks pretty good. Right now. And then you're gonna wanna go to um, FX. And this stuff doesn't really matter that much unless you just want to, it, unless you just don't like your intro at all. That stuff doesn't really matter. Try to make be a, quick, a pretty quick video. Um, if you want to change other stuff on it, like 3D or 2D, 2D or stuff like that. Like this. I like 2D. I like 2D more, so I'm gonna keep it like that. But you can turn it to 3D too. But I'm gonna keep it at 2D because I like that better. And then this stuff doesn't matter too much, but you can like add add a bunch of other stuff to it. Like you can change this to 10 seconds. It'll shake more then. Okay, so then you're gonna go to music, and I'll show you a bunch of different steps to this. So um, how you do this is you go to a music that you want, like this song. It's a good song. Um, I'll have a link in the description for this song. And then you're wanting to copy the link right here. You're going to want to copy the link. Then go to like, uh, I, I recommend this one. You just have to type in MP3 to YouTube. And then go down and you'll see this. YouTube to MP3 per converter. Or, I mean, YouTube to MP3. So then you're wanting to click on that. And then it'll bring you to this um, converter. So then you're gonna paste your link in and convert it. It felt like this whole thing was gonna be over, but it's not. I think there's an ad somewhere on here. Okay, Don't you know about what goes on at the school? This is proof of who they all are. So you're going to want to download it. Then when it finishes uploading, you're going to want to download it. And then it's as easy as that. It'll come. It'll show you. Do you want to keep this? And yes, you press OK. It, it doesn't give you a virus or anything, or it, it never has for me at least. And so then you'll have it. So then you can go back to your um, clip maker. Then you can 
put your select music and then you'll find your music and then you'll click open on it but I don't really want to use that music right now but um that's pretty much it and then like you'll this is where you put where you want the music to start so if I wanted to start at 32 seconds which is the which is basically the downbeat it's where I would start it it would be like this So like if you wanted it at 32.5, then you just type 32.50. Or if you just wanted it at zero, you just type zero. Or wherever you want the music at. So like if it's at two minutes, you put 120. Because that's 120 seconds, point zero zero. That's what you do. And um, so the volume mode, you just, like, you can fade it in and out. But custom sounds better to me. And then once you're finished with all that, this just doesn't matter too much. You're going to go to the download part. You're going to click on ba um, balance because it's the best and to me. Or, if, yeah, whichever you want to use. But to me, balance is the best. Then you just do that and start video render. And then it'll take 15 to 20 minutes usually to download it. And then you'll have the intro. And then you can just put it in with your videos. I suggest using Windows Movie Maker. That's what I use. It's it works really well with my intro with my videos because you can just edit. You can just put the intro in first, then you put your video in after that, and it works perfectly fine. And it and it's free too. So, but you have to have a Windows or like Mac or something to use it. But I'll leave all these links for for the MP3 converter, the the music, the uh, Panzoid. And um, I'll leave all the and Windows Movie Maker. I'll wait, leave all those in in the description so you can check those out and you can make your own intro. And this is probably the easiest way to make an intro for free. I mean, there's t tons of different intros you can use. There's even outros on here. And if you want me to do a video on that, I can too sometime. But um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next video and hope you enjoy this video. And check out the description. Links in the description. See you guys.